You already know what time it is. May 30th, 2019. What's in the shop today? Fortnite. Takara. Oh, that wrap is kind of cool. Pickaxe and glider. Sh Shamisen. Sh Shamisen. I can't read that. And engaged. That's a cool glider. This skin looks pretty fucking mean, dude. The back bling's pretty sick. I don't like her boots, but other than that, she's pretty solid. My support a creator code, guys, within the item shop is Pizzo with a zero. If you're not using me, please use somebody. You know we're getting it. Yes! Converge is the weapon wrap. Cycle it a little bit. You know, we're going to show you when that looks sick in game. That's a really nice wrap. I like the design on it. I mean, red and white we already have, but the design looks really good. You know, we're getting it. Yes! The pickaxe, um, it is a guitar. No, it looks like a bass. This is a three-string bass guitar. Um, Shamison, I'm just gonna call it that. It sounds pretty fucking heavy. It reminds me of like Ice Pick, like the, the shovel, the uncommon shovel. You know, we're getting it. Yes! The glider is engaged. I like the studs on it. The red and white color scheme is great. One more time. This is nice, a uh, nice uh, uncommon glider. I think they could have pushed it to a rare, but they didn't. So that's great. You know, we're getting it. Yes. So first things first, the new wrap looks really good. Let's show it on a couple weapons here. It looks sick, dude. Red and white. It's got yeah, nice, uh, it's like a nice pattern, how it's laid out on the weapons. It looks really good. Thank you for that sub. Caleb, I appreciate it, brother. The Barret. Just the, the, the design placement is great. We're no strangers to red and white weapon wraps, but the design alone looks really good. Thank you for that sub. Fort Pro TV. Drum gun is juicy. She's got some knuckles on her. They're not really brass knuckles, but they look painful. They look like bear claws to rip apart like a really uh, a really soft meat like a brisket. <laughs> uh, let's see it on some vehicles here. The chair looks really good. Other than that, um, the inside is just like a black, like a chrome almost. Not a chrome, it's like a glossy black. Hoverboard has a nice design on it. It reminds me of like some pinstriping on the end there. This looks great. It's just the design placement is everything. It looks really good. I like the points, the angles. It's really cool. Very nice. Yoink! And I missed. So let's see this pickaxe now. We got the red fluff helping out. Thanks, brother. It sounds good. Hitting opponents. Let's get a shield away first. Hashtag no homo. Hey, it's thank you for uh, two months, brother. Welcome back. All right, hitting opponents without a shield. It sounds good. It almost reminds me of. It reminds me of like a thin, almost like a, a cookie cutter type of sound. And it also sounds like you're hitting someone with like a big balloon, like them sock and bopper things. I know it's like a weird description, but that's what I'm hearing. Both of those combined. So think about it. Cookie sheet and sock and boppers. Because it sounds like a, like a, a thick piece of balloon plastics, if that makes any sense. Um, let's see if we can get a glider here for you guys. So no crazy sounds here, no contrails. Um, interaction is what it usually is for these uh, design of gliders. Uh, it looks clean though. It looks really good. The color scheme is great. It looks awesome. You can really see like the things on her knuckles too in the glider. It's hard to explain what they are. It's not really a brass knuckle because it's not over her knuckles, but they're definitely on her hands. They look painful. Farming various materials. Let's 
get an ADS here for you guys, even though we already did, but just a more in-depth one. Standing, standing and walking, crouching, crouching and walking. That back bling's pretty cool, man. I like it. And let's see if we can't book sure these sweaty 90s. For Japan! No! <laughs> right at the end, dude. Let's try that one more time. I'm not going to edit that, I promise. For Japan! Let's go. That was better. But no, man. It's it's a nice set. I don't... Her boots are still kind of a nice order to me. She's like wearing some, some spacers down there. I don't know what kind of style of boot that is. Other than that, it looks good. I like... Again, with the short jacket. Season 9, they are loving shortcut jackets. But she does have some studs on it. I had a studded belt like that in high school, but it was white, a white leather studded belt. Super punk rock dudes. Anyways, let's get all the backlinks on my girl here and Red Fluff. Thank you for the help, brother. I like the color scheme. I will say that. Color scheme is juicy. The boots are a little sus. Her little her little hand ornaments look pretty scary. Um complete set, weapon wrap, super good. Gliders, uncommon, very affordable. The pickaxe is, I'm going to call it the bass guitar. It's got three really thick strings on it. Usually a bass has four. Um, your conventional bass guitar, but it's got three. So it's kind of throwing me off there. But I'm still going to call it the bass guitar nonetheless. Without a back bling, you can see she's got an interesting cut to her jacket. Um, the red circle for the Japanese flag. She also has it on her left breast. Just an observation. Um, again, the boots are kind of throwing me off. But the jacket's nice. It's like, like a Dracula collar on it. The little studs, the same that are on her um, her glider as well. Those studs, they're not really a... Sp they're like a really dull spiked stud. That looks great. Um, we're familiar with a lot of red and black combos here. Um, some of my favorite... I mean, Iconic is really good. Black Knight, one of my favorites. Wearing red with Black Knight is awesome. So we could should get some juicy combos here. That's okay, actually. I like the way it sits. That's not bad. That's pretty cool. She got some cheeks on her, I'll tell you that. I was not expecting a skin like this. You guys know I tried my very hardest to avoid the leaks. So I had no idea <laughs> this was coming out. So I'm pretty shocked. Not the mama. Pretty shocked. It looks pretty good though. A little scary. I still don't have these unlocked yet. Holy. You would think I'd have them unlocked by now. I'm like almost level 70 in season nine. Still don't have those unlocked for Lux. Feels bad. That looks good. Those are great. Gold is eh, not feeling gold. Ice spikes should look good with the cut of her jacket. The red ones look juicy. That's okay. Ice Kings look better for the white or the silver. The gold, I'm not feeling it. Those are a 50-50, both of these, the lava ones. Uh, that's not bad. She actually looks pretty nice right here. Kind of. That's cool. Kind of gross though, but it was cool. Nah, I do. I think about a thunder crash. That's a stretch with the purple back blings on her. But you could pull it off if you wanted to. I think ignition and lane speed are gonna look really good. That looks great. She has no blue on her outfit, but I think with the flags, it's still good. That looks great too. I like the the points on it. Matches her like a, the vibe of her studs. I like that. Six three, no thanks. Chiro, no thank you. No, 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 no. Toothpick in your burger, no thanks. Supported creator is not case sensitive, guys. It can be lowercase. As long as it's the right character and or numbers, you're fine. So if it's lowercase P-I-Z, and then you have like the zero, it'll still work. But if you're not using me, please use somebody. Germany looks good. So yeah, it is not case sensitive. See, China and Japan together. Canada looks great. We got all the decks unlocked today. Feels great. The all black one is pretty juicy. Other than that, I don't think anything else is gonna match. Maybe this orange one. Nah, not so much. I'd say that the all black one is your best bet. The blank deck. Um, all the others just really wasn't feeling it. That's kind of cool. Although the gold, the gold's throwing me off because she doesn't have any gold on her. 
she has like the silver studs and stuff so i don't i'm not feeling too gold oh that looks good nothing gold really the dogs maybe probably only the red one if you had to choose one i do the one with the red collar bogey bag is it's not bad red and black can't go wrong that's kind of cool as well We can take it off sub only mod, uh, mods if you don't mind. I appreciate it. Thank you. Callus is juicy. This is cool. The Odin uh, dog bowl feels good. Um, again, with the if you use like the thunder crash, could be cool, but that's a stretch. It's a stretch. Thanks, Equalizer. That's very cool. Looks really good. Stream. Don't just try to keep your eyes up. We went through this. With previous skins already, just try to keep your eyes up on the back wing, okay? We can do this, guys. This ain't the first time. That looks good. That's what it came with, obviously. Very aggressive. That's cool. That's not bad. Ugh. Um, probably the only one would be purple. Again, with the, with the red and purple, if you wanted to try to use it. That's pretty cool. Zoe's wedgie bag stinks so bad. That's pretty cool. Too bulky. Hamira's gross. No thanks. Nope. Nah. Mm -mm. Ignition hot and fresh out the kitchen looks pretty good. Nope. Nah. Hip shakers. No thank you. Nah. Um, I don't personally like this. The only time I wore it was for the fort bite that I had to collect. The red one looked okay though. Lanesbury looks good. Those are not bad. A little weird with the red. She has like a very saturated red. Like that's a good, a good color of red on her her outfit. It's got like a little bit of metallic vibe to it as well. We saw these already. We're just gonna skip that row. That looks good. Uh, kinda. It's like a stretch. Andadasi. Not really. Nah. Eh. Mm, no, nah. Mm -mm. I kind of like it. Doesn't make sense, but red and green. Oh, da da C part two. No thanks. I would probably rock the skull one for this if I had to choose one. And it's okay. I really don't like the way it looks. It goes well with your pants. I like it. A lot of white. Mm, I'd say sure. Crack shot. Why not? It's okay. Not so much. Those look good. Uh, Spyro, that's a big no for me. An easy no for me. Uh, Rust Bucket, maybe 50-50. I probably wouldn't wear it, though. There's way better matches you can get other than that Rust Bucket. That's not the right red. I'm going to say no, not really. It's the right red, but oh, that purple throw me off, dude. That's kind of cool. She doesn't have any pink on her, but you could use it. That looks good. I like that. The turquoise is fine. Uh, not really. No, no, no. Mm, not really. No, no thanks. Pass. All of these are big nope skis for me. Just judging by the color scheme, I know they are, and it's not going to look good. Nope. Nope. Yes. Craig Jones from Slipknot. I think that's his name. Their synthesizer player. Craig Jones. I think it's his name. That one looks good, too. That looks pretty good, but I, I don't like wearing them, personally. Not bad. Pretty cool. How many chucks do I have? That's what I saw out of the corner of my eye. I think I've only had about four pairs of Chuck Taylors, honestly. About four pairs, I think. Maybe, uh, I don't know, actually. I would say less than 10, for sure. No more than 10. That looks good. That looks good. That's so random. That's the only thing I saw on Twitch chat was how many Chucks do you have? <laughs> I have way more Vans than I do uh, Converse Chuck Taylors. They're both the flat footed shoes, so I think I can just pull off Vans a lot easier. Chuck Taylors always look like, um, at least from my perspective, like clown shoes on me. <laughs> I got a size 11. I don't know why they seem like they're so big on me. From my perspective, they remind me of clown shoes, but I do like chucks. Some all black chucks I could rock for sure. 
Um, no, the other one looked way better. That's not bad. Not really. I would like colored edit styles for this. It's a very cool, compact back bling. I would love edit styles for those in terms of colors. That'd be awesome. That's good. A little bulky though. Not bad. Pretty cool. I kind of like it. It's got the same colored red on the bow. So, eh, it's a stretch. Tabulator. That's kind of cool. In the Jansport back bling. Takara, does it match the given rarity? Um, I think it's okay. Two out of two. Color scheme is great. I love red and black, and uh, there's a lot more white than red and black, but it looks good. Did it match a decent amount? I'll give it a one out of two. No loss of visibility. Um, two out of two there. And do I see myself using it regularly? Probably not. So I'll give it a seven out of 10. Yoink. Shamison, that's what we're calling it. I probably butchered it. Doesn't match a given rarity. Um, I say it's fair. Yeah, I like that. Color scheme. Um, a lot of metal and some red. Um, pretty basic there. One out of two. I like the equip sound. Uh, it's kind of bleh. Impact swing sound is cool. Two out of two. And you want to see most stuff using it regularly? Um, I like that it resembles a bass guitar. So for that fact, I'll give it a two out of two. I think I might. I've been asking for a bass guitar for a long time. So eight out of ten. Yoink. As we usually do, there's not a ton of visual effects for uncommon gliders. There's a very small handful. So we're only going to give it, at best, an eight out of eight. So does it match the rarity? Yes, it does. Color scheme is awesome. Two out of two. Deploy sound, nothing really significant there. One out of two. And do I see myself using it regularly? Um, I'll give it a one out of two there. So we're looking at a six out of eight because we are not. Yoink. Yoink. Um, counting visual effects for uncommon. It's a little unfair um, because, like I said, not a lot of them have visual effects. The rap is great. Very cool design. I like where it's placed. The red accents. Very cool. 10 out of 10 for Converge. And with that being said, guys, liking the video is always appreciated. Subscribing is free. And we'll see you in there. It's on the live stream. That is Pizza with a Zero and Item Shop. See you.